Okay, welcome to today's tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to do what's called now mesh swapping. This is the proper way to clone a, a character package onto another character. In essence, swapping meshes. Okay, so for this tutorial, I'm going to show you how I created my Cyber Shinnok. It's very simple. This is my modded Takeda, which is Kenshi Jr. A. So we're just going to clone this over to Shinnok R, which would be my Cyber Shinnok. So original string is car package name costume letter. New string is costume that I'm cloning it to, which is Shinnok R. I'm gonna put a check mark in the first box. that check mark, put a check mark in the second box, and remove the prefix from both of these. Replace those strings. And now we remove the suffix and replace all the strings. This last step here is what adds the correct strings for the sounds and textures. <clears throat> All right. Okay, but we are still not done yet. So, when cloning packages onto other characters, in essence, do the mesh swap, you will want to reattach objects or weapons that are used on the new character you're cloning to. In this example, Shinnok has a staff, so I need to attach that staff onto Takeda's mesh, which I just swapped. So to locate the correct strings, I'm going to open up Shinnok's primary costume, which is costume A, and do a simple text search in hex for the word attach. There'll be several strings in here. You'll always see a heart attach. That's not it. So here we see left scepter attach. So this is what Shinnok uses <coughs> on his bone shaper variation. So I need to attach this to Takeda. So now I'm going to open up my Takeda one and search for the same string attach to see what I can replace here. And here we see there's a left energy stick. So there'll be left energy stick, right energy stick. Um, he also has left whip and right whip. And remember when working with packages you can't extend string length, you can only match or lessen string length. So in this case, left scepter attached, we're just going to do this really quick in hex to compare bite size, just it's easier to see for you guys. Obviously this will fit. So this will be the string that we want to replace. So in the renamer, original string is going to be left energy stick attach and new string will be left scepter. We'll repeat this for the right on each one. Left and right usually means left side of player two, right side of player two, which is how it attaches objects when you're facing either on the left or right hand side of the screen. This is also very simple. Just replace strings. And 
again, we're going to do this for right side. That's it, so I have now cloned a cyber that I created using Tenshi's base onto Shinnok, as Shinnok R. Already added him to my game, so now I'm going to show you what it looks like with the staff atta the scepter attached. something and enjoy the video. Leave a, leave a like, subscribe for more. Thank you.